I am so excited to be in the Women Know Cyber book. We absolutely know cyber, and I am the first one featured. And I like to think I'm the first one featured because, you know, I'm just that fabulous, but it's in alphabetical order. <laughs> My nickname is Dr. J, and I kind of coined that nickname when I got my PhD. I wanted to brand myself and, and make it resonate with other people. And I know of Dr. J from the basketball fame, and I thought he was just always very creative. And I wanted to bring the same level of creativity and range that Dr. J brought to basketball. I want to bring the same thing to cybersecurity. So that's kind of where Dr. J comes from. I grew up in a small town, Albany, Georgia. My mother is a mathematician. My father has his degree in physics, so that scientific mindset has been imprinted on me early on. I am a certified cryptologic engineer. It is a specialized training that the Department of Defense takes you through. You can be a certified cryptologic engineer, a certified cryptologic mathematician. There are different tracks. I took the engineering track. And that's kind of how I started my career. I started my career within the Department of Defense, building algorithms that go into a lot of the cryptographic systems. So a lot of people think that, and especially, you know, I've got six kids. None of them think they're gonna use their math um, schooling at all, right? And actually you do. Um, there are a lot of things that we use mathematics for. So it was an easy transition for me to go to a math degree, to doing cryptography, to doing technology, and now to doing cybersecurity. When you think about algorithms and data science, a lot of it is logic-based, and logic is based on math. I actually did my dissertation on the introduction of products, technology products, into an environment based on game theory, based on what move is this person gonna make? What move is this company gonna make? And how am I gonna to react to that move? All of that, whether you think that's emotionally based, it's really based on mathematics and what the real term is what the payout is. And that is a mathematical equation. And those who learn that and those who know that are those who win because we are playing to win. Our minds are conditioned to play to win. And so if you think at any point that mathematics is not used Oh, it absolutely is. Those who are winning are playing a mathematical game. <laughs>